Hey Saber Builders, welcome to another Saber video. Uh, well, I'm going to start this over after I get this free. Hey there Saber Builders, it's me with another video, surprise surprise. Uh, pretty much just going to be showing you how to put together a blade this time. I mean, nothing terribly fancy about it. Just got my two-part epoxy, something to squirt it on, a towel, paper towel, uh, mixing stick, and of course, you can probably see them on the ground here, my polycarbonate tube. Uh, I actually ordered this online and got uh, three segments in eight-foot sections, so chop those into three 32-inch blades each, so yeah, pretty awesome. Just gotta wipe off the end here before we apply glue to it, but pretty much we're gonna glue this in here. I know, exciting. Uh, just thought I'd show the steps while I'm doing them. Might as well make a quick video. So, all you have to really do is follow the instructions for your two-part epoxy. So, get that off. And this stuff, then you mix it until it's all one color. Probably could have used something smaller than this. This isn't a very good thing to mix on. But it's kind of smelly. Make sure you do this in a well-ventilated area. You can probably hear my fans going. Uh, that's just so I keep the air moving and don't make myself sick. This stuff starts to give me a headache after a while, just from the resin. And then you just kind of take it and I just kind of paint it on. Try not to get any on the lens. a nice even coat. So, yep, it's all covered. Stick that to that. And then all you do is ever so gently slide it in, twist a little bit to get the glue to spread out, and press it down. Now what I do here is there's some glue coming out the side, so what I like to do is twist it, wipe away the excess. So, this stuff is supposed to dry clear, so it shouldn't be too much of a problem if there's some. I got these tips from the custom saber shop. Uh, I've done a couple other blades. Here's one I did a few minutes ago. Uh, looks pretty good. Looks alright. These are just the blank ones though. These don't have the film in them yet. I'll probably film me putting that in tomorrow. So this probably will be the second half of the video in a little bit. But this is the stuff I bought. This I also bought online. Uh, found some great links for where to buy just the blade supplies. And so far it's turned out to be a good deal. I mean comparably to what you save it's, it's a pretty good deal. I mean buying blades like these from a, like any of the places that sell saber blades I don't know, per blade it's like 17 and up. This total per blade is costing me like 12 bucks maybe so, pretty good deal. Uh, I'll get the second part of this video recorded and then edit these together, so see y'all tomorrow. Hey Saberland, it's me with another with the second part to this video of Saber Blade Building. Uh, in the first part, uh, you watched me assemble the polycarbonate tube along with the tip with the mirror in the, on the inside edge of it. So. Now we're going to do the diffuser film part of it. This is just some gift wrap film that was recommended on the forums that I ordered from the factory. Same as with the polycarbonate tube, ordered it from the factory. Easy enough to find online. This is a dowel that we'll be wrapping the film around so we can insert it into the rod. 
So I'm just going to go through the steps and show you what I do. I've already done this a couple of times, so yeah. Uh, generally you measure out about five feet worth of user film, so I measured my table, it just so happens to be five feet. even with that and then a little extra doesn't hurt. So roll it out. It's roughly five feet. Take a nice sharp pair of scissors. And just cut it. Then you can set your rat aside. Take your dowel, make sure it's nice and clean, just kind of brush it off. This one had some dust on it before. Then I just get it rolling. Alright, so, rolls it up, as you can see, it's not totally even, but not a big deal. We're going to stick it in the tube and fix that in a second, so, you want to grab your blade, just kind of make sure the wrap doesn't get in the way, and slide it into the polycarbonate tube. And I usually sit down and grab this and twist it in the opposite direction this is wrapped around so it kind of pushes the wrapping out to the edge of the tube and then you can just slide that out and now you've got stuff just inside the tube. Now I've got some stuff inside the tube still because I was not a very clean worksman when putting this together. So there's a little bit of gunk at the end, not a big deal they won't notice. But next you're going to want to do is I'm just going to put this down. I'm going to go grab a saber so we can see how this looks. So I grabbed two sabers. I've been checking them with the red LED. So I'll just put the film in there and just look it over. It looks alright. Doesn't look like there's anything major in there. A little bit of dirt or grime or something in there. A little bit of fuzz stuff. Not a big deal. Or you can do it with the blue. It's harder to see with the blue, so if you're doing your own, I recommend a blue LED stuff that you pick up as well. So if you're checking, definitely go with the red because everything kind of pops with it. So yeah, just make sure your work surface is clean and you've done the other stuff beforehand. And then once you're done, you just grab your trusty scissors and I'm gonna pull this out a little bit. There we go. Now if we have a I'll probably put a dab of glue in here later and call it good. But otherwise this is a completed blade and doesn't look too bad. So thanks for checking out the video. Uh this was made simply because I couldn't find a good video on how people were putting these together. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, but still, nice to have a visual aid. So, thanks for watching.